All right, ants part five. I haven't done an ants uh, series in a while, so it's been a year since I've done or since I've last recorded an ants video, which was back in 2022. Wow. Back at that time, my grandma was still able to walk, and now she can't no more. But dang, no offense or anything, it's it's facts, but... I can't even use my computer because there's way too many ants on the table. They got the desk. Hold on. There's a lot, you see? You see that? Oh uh, well, man. When I get a when I get a Galaxy S twenty four Ultra in twenty twenty five. Sorry, let me repeat this, but I'm gonna say a little bit more clearly. I'm gonna get a Galaxy S twenty four Ultra in twenty twenty five. I'm trying to say it more clearly. All right. Sorry for not saying it clearly. That's why I'm repeating, cause I don't say things clearly, and it's hard for me to say clearly for some reason. But, uh, yaws. So, in, so in the next two years, my phone is gonna be able to zoom in way more than, than my current phone can. So, that Galaxy S24 Ultra will be able to zoom in by, like, eight times more. I'm not combining the, the zoom, the zoom multiplier. Um, I'm multiplying the zoom level. So... By the time I get that Galaxy uh, S S24 Ultra, the zoom level is going to be way better. Like, the max zoom will be even better than this phone. I'll be able to zoom in even closer than this phone can. Because this, this phone that I'm currently using right now to record as of right now is a Samsung Galaxy S20 uh, 5G Fan Edition. Yeah, it's pretty old, alright? I only had this phone for, like... Almost two years. I got this phone like September something, twenty twenty one. So it's about to turn two years old next month on September. So as of recording right now, it's currently August fourth, twenty twenty three, and and just letting you guys know because I'm bored. That's why, you know. But hopefully, by time it's by time it's September. Or before September, I should get voice chat on Roblox. Hopefully, I'll, I'll probably get voice chat on Roblox by the time it's either September or or when it's the end of August or something like that. Between those those two dates. Yeah, between those times. Yeah. I might. I don't know yet. But it really depends, you know? It really depends. I'm just waiting for my ID card to be ready to be available. It should be available in like four weeks. So in four weeks, I'll be able to verify my age on Roblox. And then I'll get voice chat by that time. And then after I get voice chat, I'll be able to use the camera update. I already have the camera update, but I just don't have voice chat enabled because I didn't verify my age. So that's why. Even if I had my phone number verified... They still won't give me voice chat even if I have my phone number verified. That's the that's the worst thing about Roblox. And what sucks about Twitter is that you have to be on mobile in order to get these exclusive features. Like most of the most of the features of of X, aka you know, aka Twitter, like previously known as Twitter. So if I'm stuttering, it's because like I'm thinking too hard. That's why. So what sucks about X, previously known as Twitter, uh, is that you have to be, like, most of the features for X is is only available on mobile users. For, so you have to have, like, an iPhone or tablet or, or, or something like that. Not tablet, an iPad. I'm so stupid. I meant to say iPad. I meant to say iPad. My bad. I keep on, like... Uh, saying things like incorrectly, so my bad. My brain just 
can barely process at the moment. It just it can't process good enough, so that's why. And yeah, I guess I have to be either on iPad or or iPhone in order to get the exclusive features for X. So like, so like you can only go live on Twitter only if you're on mobile, but not Android. Like it's not available for Android users, so that's the most frustrating thing ever, man. I have, a, I have a Samsung phone and I can't even go live on Twitter all because I have to be to have a mobile phone or all because I have to be on mobile in order to do that that's stupid X or Elon Musk fix this right now no offense or anything Elon Musk fix your platform so that all the features so that the so that the mobile only features also are also available on both mobile and Android why not Make it available on both mobile and Android, Elon Musk. How about that? How about make both those features available on both mobile and Android so that I don't have to get a, a iPhone in order to, to go live or in order to like turn off DMing. God damn, this is why X sucks because those features are only available on mobile. That's just frustrating if you're an Android user. Like Android users miss out because they, because they're not like... A mobile user, you know, that's just stupid. I don't know why. I don't know why. I don't understand why those features are only available for mobile users. Like, I don't get it, man. That is so offensive and that is so wrong. That is so messed up. That's not cool, Elon, to ha only have those features only available for mobile. Like, fix your platform or something. No offense or anything, man. Hey, come on, Elon. You're better than that. You're better than this, okay? Make your platform, like, more better or something. Otherwise, people are going to hate on it. And the new, the new logo, too, which isn't new anymore since it happened uh, at the end of July. It happened in late July. I was, like, last month. A day. Before it was August, there wasn't that many ants. There weren't even ants at all. But what, right when August just came, they started having, they're, they're, like, ants just started showing up right when August just came. But before that, back in July, ants didn't show up. Like, they didn't appear, you know? The ants just started appearing yesterday when I woke up and then decided to use my period. And then all of a sudden, I see ants on my desk. But not that many. Yesterday, there were much less ants on my desk than there than they are today. So today there's way more ants than there were yesterday. It's like they're multiplying. It's like as as it gets hotter over the days during summer, uh, the ants just start to multiply or something like that. Like there's like more and more ants every single day. And that's why I tell you summer sucks. Alright? That's why I tell you tell, that's why I'm telling you guys that I hate summer because Every summer or every four seasons, there's always ants over here. Every summer, man. That is why I hate summer so much. Summer sucks. No offense or anything. All right? No offense for for those who love summer. No offense, all right? I'm just giving my honest opinion about summer. So no offense or anything. You don't have to be offended or anything and all that. But I just wish that there were never ants at my house whenever it's summer. But that's just how it is, you know? It's insect season or something like that. I think it's it's technically like insect season or something. And that's why there's like so many ants. It's probably insect season or something. God dang. The homeowner is just too cheap and too low on budget or something. Well, not... Well, the homeowner is just really rich. But... But they're just... They, they're just saving too much money, that's why. They, they're just going low on budget to save a ton of money, that's why, man. And they're just too lazy to afford something for the house that I'm living in, you know? They're just too lazy to make the house a little bit better. Because they just wore that. It costs too much money, you know? To, uh, I don't know how to say it. To, like, cover the house so that... The termites will die or something like that. Like exterminating like termites or something. I don't know. Like bro, there's just too much dirt outside. That's why, man. 
if that if if there wasn't so much dirt outside or or like at my house or something like that like in the yard in the front and backyard then then these ants wouldn't be the case all right then that wouldn't be the case, and these ants wouldn't show up if there wasn't, like, dirt at my house. Like, in both the front and backyard. Yeah, that's always the problem every summer, man. Like, the grass is dead. The grass, like, the like the tall, like the tall grasses have been cut, alright? And there's the problem. So, I need to tell you guys something. YouTube falsely took down... Our stream, and they accused, they accused me of using hate speech inside the stream. They accused me. That's literally the most false reason ever. That is literally the most false. It, that was literally the most lame excuse for YouTube to come up with. Okay, no offense or anything, YouTube, but that is the most lame excuse that YouTube could ever come up with. Just to take down the live stream. Like, hate speech or hateful speech. That is the most lame excuse that they can come up with. Just to take down the stream. They're just doing this on purpose. Because they don't want the channel to be up on YouTube. They just, they're just probably hating on the channel. They're just probably ratting me out. You know, like, no, not not just me. But, but anyone, like, anyone who's on the TCD channel, you know. Which is me. So not only me, but they're just writing me and Bay out, you know? Since Tim is no longer on the channel because he left a, back in 2020. It was probably when he left the channel or something. And... Uh, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh yeah, when I tried to like make an appeal with YouTube... Uh, to... to I, I want to make an appeal with YouTube. When I was making an appeal with YouTube just to get the stream back up... They rejected it. Like, bruh, that is not cool, man. YouTube, that isn't cool. That's not cool to take down someone's stream and then reject the peer. That's just disrespect, YouTube. YouTube is just disrespecting me and buddy at this point. They're just disrespecting the channel by rejecting the pew, man. That is just disrespect. That is not good. That is... They're, they're, okay, after they rejected a pew, they... They sent me an email with all this, all these lame excuses inside the email of why they rejected the appeal. All they put was just lame excuses on the, on the appeal for like inside my Gmail. Like so inside, so they sent me an email saying that they rejected it, and then and then all I see was just lame excuses inside the inside the email that they sent me when they rejected the appeal. Like they put all these lame excuses in there just to get away with it. YouTube is just no offense or anything, but I say YouTube is a bad person or a bad company or platform because they would because their their copyright strict I mean their copyright system is too strict. Alright? It's too strict. Way too strict. They keep falsely taking down these these streams and making accusations, and then they just make up excuses. And then whenever they reject the appeal, they just make up these excuses in the appeal email. That's just not cool, man. Like they don't have. That's not a good reason and not a good right to take down the streams. Why do they have the right to falsely take down the stream and ruin a channel, a perfectly good channel, man? Like, they're ruining their own platform by doing that. They're just making people hate on them for doing that. That's why. That's the problem with YouTube, man. And that is why YouTube isn't a good platform. No offense or anything. Just say. YouTube, stop making your copyright, your copyright system strict. It's too strict and I hate it. It's too strict for me to even handle it. Make it way more lenient. Stop making it strict. That's messed up. So that's why YouTube needs to fix the copyright system. And I've been hating on YouTube since 2017. Because in 2017, I've been having so many technical difficulties with YouTube back in 2017, you know? And I was like so mad at YouTube at the time. And to this day, I'm still mad at them. Six years later. I've been pissed off at YouTube for six years now, man. Ever since I first had a channel back in 2017, which said that my, well, my first channel was like, was actually created in 
2016, September 2016, and it was created by my school account. Somehow, that channel was created in 2016. Randomly, all of a sudden, that channel was automatically created in 2016. Oh, my bad, excuse me, I just burnt. Uh, that channel was created in 2016 by my school account. Like, I don't know how or, or why I created that channel, or I don't know how that channel was created, but then I decided to call it Spox, uh, plays Roblox with Minecraft or something like that. I don't know, but y'all guys, yeah. I can't record for more than 17 minutes on this phone because my storage is basically low. I only have 128 gigabytes on this phone, so, yeah. This phone sucks because it doesn't have enough storage. This is a problem, so... When I get a new phone in a couple of years, it's probably gonna have like 512 gigabytes or something or more than that, and then I I won't have to worry anymore. Okay. Uh, this has become like like a talking video more or vlog rather than like an ants vlog. Dang. There's a lot more ants, but I can't record any longer, so I have to like stop the video and delete my my other videos just so that I can continue to I don't know so that I can continue to like record okay ah so I had to delete some recordings off of the phone because they were taking up a lot of storage that my phone only have two yeah, I mean, like, my, my phone only had 2 gigabytes of storage left until it's full. So, yeah, I had to delete some files, or not files, like, recordings in order to free up space. And then now I have more space to record for more time. So, that sucks about having a 128 gigabyte phone. 128 gigabytes still isn't enough for recordings, just say. I just... I would say 512 would be good enough. But if that's not good enough, then I'll have then I have to wait for like the better phones to come out that have more storage in that. Like one or two terabytes, that would be cool. But yours. Alright. Alright, okay. I have some more footage of the ants and my phone is hot right now, but I had to make this recording quick. Alright. All right, dang ants, man. Those ants, dang, dang, man. All right. So I realized that I've used up almost half the storage of the of the Google Drive. You know, of I met Bay's Google Drive. You know, I've used up like almost half half of his shared drives storage you know like i've i've used up like half of his shared drives storage and it's it's using up 48 so like the shared drive right now from his school district well it's it, it saves 48 out of 100 gigabytes of storage so yeah used up 48 gigabytes of of like his heart of his shared drive storage and well, almost half of it, but but it's gonna be full soon because of these recordings, and so we have to like use it wisely. You know, we have to use the storage wisely because there's a limit on the shared drive. I thought there was a way bigger limit than a hundred gigabytes, but a hundred gigabytes on a shared drive uh, isn't enough storage. Damn. But all right. Hey, look at those ants. Just recording now. Alright. And that. Ants part 5. This is split into two recordings because my last one... Um... Because my the last one, I couldn't record more than 17 minutes, just like what I said last recording. So, I had to delete the other videos on my phone to free up space, just saying. So, if I'm repeating, I'm just saying because I don't know what else to say. So, that's why I might sometimes repeat. So, sorry about that. 
So this is a part two recording then. This is a part two recording for the part five. This is a second part of Ants Five. Ants Four was last year, just saying. It's just too many ants. There's like there's like there's some over here. There's some over here. God damn. Alright. Yeah, there's ants like over here and there's like one over there. There's like there's one over there and then one over here. That's crazy. That is crazy, man. Like those ants are really hungry. My my house is now infested with ants again after four seasons had passed. And now it's been exactly four seasons. And then four seasons later, it's back to summer again where it's going to be infested with ants again. Just like, uh, just like always, man. Like every year, there's always going to be ants. Like a ton of them inside my house. Everywhere, man. Just like a huge line of ants. Like a really long line of ants. Just everywhere, man. Every summer. It's like that every year. That sucks, man. That's why I'm living at this house for like... I've been living at this house for 12 years and it sucks so far. So far living here sucks because every summer... It's always like this every summer, you see? It's like this every summer... That's why. This house is the house that I lived in that has the most ants so far. This is the only house I've ever lived in that has, like, the most ants ever. While the other houses that I previously had lived at before I moved didn't even have that much ants. Or didn't have ants. Like, back at my old house, back in 2009, there weren't even ants there. I think the house is like back at like, I don't remember what, what like street or, yeah, what street it was. I think it was, I don't remember the name of the street, I forgot. But, yeah, but I did remember what the house looked like before I moved over here. Alright. I did remember what the inside looked like before I moved over here. And I was only a baby at the time, and I still somehow remember the inside of the house at the time, even the old bathroom. Back at my old house, there was only one bathroom, but the house that I'm currently living out, yeah, the, the one that I'm currently living at right now has like two bathrooms, so double that. Alright, y'all, this was just ants, though. Eh. Every summer, this has to be a problem for everyone living here. Anyone who's living here. Or have that problem. Or experience that issue. Yeah, so every once in a while I make a recording of the ants because I'm bored. I got nothing to do. That's just what I do on the channel. Well, but he's not here and he's just doing his own thing. You know, like on TikTok every day, just saying, you know. He's on TikTok every, every day. Like, you know like, the social media he uses is just probably either YouTube or TikTok or something like that. I'm just saying, you know. Like, he doesn't use any other social media, just saying. No offense or anything. Or maybe he just doesn't, he just probably doesn't use them that often. Like, you know, it's, I don't know why I'm telling you guys about, like, why he does, but I don't know. It's because I'm bored. So, my bad. My bad. I don't know anymore. Oh yeah, but he's gonna, he's gonna go back to school in like three days, and I have ten more days until I go back to school. So I'm going back to school in ten days, and he's going back to school in three days. So rip. He's gotta go back to school sooner than me. If he goes back to school sooner than me, then that means he's gonna graduate sooner than me. You know? His graduation is probably a week before mine. Because since he starts a school a week earlier than me, I and like my school ends a week after him, you know, it just it just really depends. You know? Yes. 
All right, y'all. Yes. So yeah, his summer break always starts at four months. So that's just how it is. That's how it is with different school districts living in distant cities, and then being in different school districts. Wow, y'all, yes, guys.